Good morning, Drain Team. Here we are in a lovely place called Port Sunlight. And yes, it's raining. What a way to start the new year. First job of the new year. Customers complaining of the problem with his gully. There's a very uh, accessible manhole cover. Apparently this is the offender, rises up, um, drains away very slowly. There's a toilet which is filling and then very slowly disappearing again. So there's a partial blockage isn't it? It's going to be, dare I say, it's going to be an easy job. Should I be saying that? Yeah, should they be saying that, Roger? <laughs> We're on a winner, guys. Got uh, customers making me a cup of tea. So let's have a look. Uh, <clears throat> job one, get my coat on. Trademark that throwing uh, the uh, screwdrivers at the grid. <laughs> oh, it's a big, thick uh, manhole cover, that one, isn't it? It is a big manhole cover, like I say. I, I have had it up in the past, and it? it is a big one, isn't it? Yeah. <coughs> I think I'll just put my gloves on. Drop it old fashioned on it. Yeah, well, it, uh, it looks like a, a kind of uh, a vehicular yeah, yeah. driveway one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, that was probably the original one when the house was built. Definitely, honest. yeah. You know? Yeah. Well, they're all like lightweight aluminium ones it, now, aren't they? Yeah, it's handy that the conservatory never got built over it. Yeah. In there, mate. Ah, okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, right. Even I can see that. Okay, guys, let's get in there and have a look. So, yeah, this is going to be. Got the old, uh, it's called a Windsor trap there. Right. You see that um, hole at the top? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That is below there. There's another, another hole the same size, and it's, it's like a little trap. Mm -hmm. Bloody stupid idea, but that's what they put in years ago. Uh, so job one, get the rods out and just clear that for you, and then we'll see what happens. Because I think think basically all your drains are full of uh, crud, aren't they? Yeah, isn't it? Yeah. So. Right, Roger, I'll be very clear with you. Mm -hmm. I rate the T out of 10 for the uh, camera. So, so far it's looking good. Everybody says I make a nice cup of tea. And I hope so. Well. You can get a solid 10 out of 10 for that, mate. Brilliant. That is a very Brilliant. nice... Brilliant. Everybody always says, yeah, you make your boss come is, see you. That's, that's because I love it myself. Yeah. <laughs> what, what, is that Yorkshire tea? That is Yorkshire tea. Do you know what I thought it was? You sell, you're like me. You can sell what tea it is. Do you know, I approached... Yorkshire tea's the best. I approached Yorkshire tea by email one time. Now, bearing in mind, I've got a video on there. That's it. It... 
it's it about 950,000 views it's nearly a million views one, Go away. one of my videos uh, and the other ones are, you know they do varying degrees of views and everything but there's 320 videos on, on YouTube and I, I approached a Yorkshire team and said I rate all my tea to, you know out of 10 and I always generally rate Yorkshire tea 10 out of 10 so do I. And uh, is there any collaboration? And you know, what I was, was expecting was yeah. like, here's a, t yeah. here's a box of tea bags or whatever. Bags, and, thanks. You know, and yeah, I could go, you know, go back. Yeah, yeah, but, but um, they went, so, oh, you know, we've, we've kind of, um, we have a lot of, uh, you know, approaches from people and, and we have our set budgets and all the rest of it. So, but fair enough. Um, you know, I can't really feature their tea. It is good tea. It's you know, box it, tea. Is, it is good tea. I'd love to be able to feature their tea. <laughs> but, uh, oh, well, I'm glad you like it because yeah, it's, it's like it's my favourite tea as well. Exactly. The, this is it. You know, you come out to do a train job and you can stand there talking to someone about tea for 15 minutes. I know you can, yeah. Okay. And you might have a crap cup of tea in your hand. Well, no, I like mean, it. I'll be honest with you. Yeah. That, uh, I, I'm not I'm not cruel to people, but sometimes I'll say, no, I'm afraid that I can't give you a 10 out of 10 on that. <laughs> <laughs> no, mate. Listen, mm. I, I drink tea all day, every day. So Well, that's what we do, isn't it? I know about us, the tea. Us Brits do People that. always say to me, oh my God, how many cups of tea do you have a day? And I'm just like, I've just constantly got one in my hand. Yeah. Whether I'm in work, whether I'm at home, yeah. it doesn't matter. Well, you've got to hydrate yourself, haven't you? Of course you have. We're all this business of buying Evian and... No disrespect to Evian. No. I, you know, if they want to sponsor this video, I'll, I'll take yeah. that back. Shouldn't be drinking tea, Roger. You should be drinking Evian. <laughs> it's still water, isn't it? <laughs> it is. You're still just, hydrating yourself. It's just a different colour. It just tastes a bit better. Yeah, and it's from Yorkshire. <laughs> well, in fact, Yorkshire tea is not from Yorkshire, is it? It's from India. Yeah. Uh, but it, I think it's packaged in it's probably Yorkshire. packaged in Yorkshire. I think. Still, I whatever, but they, anyway, whatever they're doing. But they're anyway, doing from Yorkshire. what I've tasted... Tetley, PZ Tips, all of them, Yorkshire tea is the best. There you go, yeah. If you listen to this, Yorkshire tea, look what you're missing out on. We I could know, be, yeah. we could be, um, well, you are millionaires, but <laughs> I could be uh, three tea bags behind you with the correct uh, <laughs> sponsorship. <laughs> right, mates, let's get this uh, show on the road. Okay. Do you need me to, like, do you need to look at that? Do you need me to run the tap or anything? No, or? let's. I'll, I'll get this trap cleared first. Okay. Then we'll start flushing toilets and all the rest and, of it. All right, sounds. But you know, I can pretty much guarantee you that the problem lies in that trap there. Yeah. And I think it's like I said to you that I've had it before, and that it's probably going to be something that's going to happen again, isn't it? But well, how long ago was it? No, I'd say years. a couple of years ago yeah. since I last done it. it it, it, it won't happen overnight, but oh, no, no, because no, of no. the design of, of the trap, I think it was a... But like, like you said, last time, last time it happened, I... Like you say, it is quite sludgy, isn't it? Yeah. I remember last time I was on it and I was, I had my hands down and everything, and it was just like, just like mud. Yeah, well, we'll get all this out here. This is, I don't know, I don't know why that's, uh... So that one there that you're going, yeah, you're going down. This is the That's like the main. This is the trap, yeah. So that's, Going to the main sewer. Yeah. Yeah. So the one above it. That's part of the trap. So what does that do? Is that just so that's supposed to be if it fills up to there it goes through there? Yeah. Right, okay. Yeah. And then it joins up with that other one. It does, yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. It, so if it so if it fills up about over that bottom one, it goes through that top one and but then it joins drain. up yeah. with it somewhere. Yeah. 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 Now um, So you know a little bit about drains. Yeah. Now normally, well not normally these days, but there used to be a little plug in the end, mm -hmm. um, which was not um, not to allow water through. So right. as it stands, yeah, if that filled up, it would run through there and yeah. drain away. But back in the old days, there used to be a plug in there. Oh, okay. 
And that plug was to stop the, the odours coming through the, the sewer smell. Right. Back in the day. Right, let's get a gully grab and clean that out. Gravel. There is a lot of gravel in it. I remember from last time when I put that thing down here, there. there is a lot of gravel. I don't know where the gravel's coming from. But there is a lot, isn't it? Yeah. The only thing I can think of is potentially uh, somewhere along the drainage between your house and here and, yeah. is there uh, could be a breach. Right, okay. Because there's if you look at it, there's no reason for the to be gravel in there, is there? Well there wouldn't be if not, you know I'm not putting, I'm putting No, no, down I know, yeah. And all like the stonework isn't falling to bits or nothing like no. that, is it? So, so potentially there is cover uh, from somewhere else. There is could be a, a broken drain. It's coming from somewhere else, isn't it? Yeah. If the bro if there's a broken drain and the the surrounding ground has fallen through the, the crack. Yeah, see what you mean now. Good little two of them. Yeah. Cue one of them. Yeah. Cue the uh, comments. Oh, you, you should have a bigger gully grab. It's only a little one. Well, you what, need a little bit of time. Well, what, what people don't get is... No, because a bigger one won't fit in there, will it? Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> listen, people. This is my customer telling you what's what's what. A bigger one won't fit. Yeah. So if you get a, if you get a five inch you gully... You just have to do a little bit of the sign, don't you? Yeah, you know that. If you have a five inch gully grab, it's not going to fit in the truck. Of course it won't. It won't, so. Do I need one of them? I've got rods. I need one of them. Yeah. But if it happens again, and it's an easy fix. Yeah, well, what I'll do once it's empty is I'll put a camera up there and have yeah, a look. Yeah, yeah. Uh, see, see what the score is, whether there's, um, whether there is actually a, a break anywhere. Oh, it's, it's solid material. <laughs> it's not that though, isn't it? Because it, it's not like it's not sanitary towels, it's not wet wipes. No, that's a lot of gravel there, mate. It's just, it's just like, I can hear it. It's just gravel, isn't it? Yeah. Where the hell's that coming from? So do you think that means like it, a main drain somewhere in the street or someone else's drain has collapsed and is affecting mine? No. no. This is this is your drain, right? And this gravel here well, is coming. Where that's come, where is, is that coming from? Well, your house there, mm. where that drain is, mm. between there and here, yeah, there could be uh, a break in the dr in the drain pipe, okay, under the floor, which is a massive job. Well, depends really. Can, sometimes they can be repaired with a patch repair. Right, okay. Where, where we send the... It's not like a proper, like, dig up. Well, I can't say until I, no, I, I know put the mean, camera but in, but we, we can do it uh, with putting a, a resin, what's called a resin patch okay. repair. Okay, right. Where okay. it's like a pipe within a pipe. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, I get, you know, sometimes the pipe inside. Yeah, pipe, sometimes yeah. you can get away with doing that. You're getting a lot of gravel out there. And I remember last time when I was robbing it, there was loads of gravel. And I, obviously, I'm not an expert like you, I know a little bit, but I was, I, I was thinking, where's all this gravel coming from? Yeah, I see it now. I think there's gravel coming out of this one here. Okay. I think that's. Do you want me to flush the toilet or not just yet. run I've... the tap around? No, I'll just get as much of this out as I can. Right. Yeah. Would it be worth if this keeps happening? Would it be worth, like you said, getting a pipe within a pipe? Hey. Or do I just get you out every couple of years to clear it? Well, or do I start doing it myself once I can? I, I honestly can't answer until no, I know. we know what's going on here yeah. because. Uh, from what looked like a relatively kind of simple, easy job. Uh, I, know, I thought it was. I thought you were just going to jet somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. See, that's the one. That's 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 the one from the kitchen that I was rotting. And then like. You know, I said to me, this is right, you can't, you can't book a restart, you can't do that, but then you can't help a little bit, can you? No. A little bit goes down, Of course, it? yeah. You know, obviously you're not going to pour a grease out of like a roasting tin. No, but when down, you're washing, are you? washing. When you're washing dishes, there's bits of grease in Yeah, there. of course. You know, it's just the way it is. I mean, <clears throat> you'll get your purists that say you should uh, wipe the dishes with... Um, Can you do that? I know. Wipe the I mean, dishes I, and throw I, the I, cloth you know, away and all Say if I'm like, say I'm roasting a chicken in the yeah. oven. Like, I won't, I won't pour all that fat down the drain. But then I wash the plates afterwards and there's obviously going to be a little bit of fat on them, isn't there? Yeah. I mean, it is what it is. Yeah. There's only so much you can do, isn't there? Yeah, it's not the Spanish Grease Inquisition, you know, Roger. Don't worry about it. No, I know. I'm just saying there's only so much you can do <laughs> to stop all of this, isn't it? Yeah, you know. the, yeah, you've got to live your life. At the end of the day... Yeah, at the end, of, at the end know, of the day... You can only do so much, can't you? Yeah. And you do what... You do what you... You know, like, you and I know what what we should do and you do what you're told to do and, and I know you shouldn't put these down. Blah, 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 and all that. But... You're gonna get this down, isn't it? Yeah, always. You know, and then you think it could be a lot worse than what it is. Right. If you want to go and uh, flush okay. the upstairs, do the downstairs first and then go and do the upstairs if you don't mind, please. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, do the upstairs do now. Do yeah, that. I think that'll come from another from this one here.
Yeah. So obviously, that's the upstairs one. Up there. And that's the downstairs one. Yeah, it'll come through, yeah. So the upstairs one's okay. Yeah. That, that trap is rammed with um, bits of gravel. Which trap? This one or that this, one? This is the trap. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, tell me about it. I've had my hand down here, scooping it out. Stand there if you don't mind, Roger. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, no, because I just put my hands in and scoop it off. Oh yeah, you mean at work? Yeah, no, here. If oh, it again, I need one of them grab things. Your are in work as well. Yeah. yeah. But yeah. Handy little tool, isn't it? Yeah. It's called a gully grab. Do okay. is uh, see that's running now, isn't it? I can see yeah, that. that's what well, this, this yeah, is clear yeah, now. Right. Um, what I'm going to do is put a jetter up the yeah. branch, up yeah. that branch there. Yeah, uh, it looks like to me, I mean, I'm not an expert, but it looks like to me it's, it's that one, isn't it? It is that one, it is, isn't it? And it'll probably just be a bit of grease and shit like that, won't it? It'll be what? Grease and stuff, won't no, it? No, it's not, mate. There's, there's all gravel in here. That gravel. I'm sorry, so there's gravel in that one. Yeah, the gravel yeah. is... It doesn't just appear from nowhere. It's no, coming, of course it doesn't. I think it's coming through uh, a breach somewhere. Mm. And when you flush the toilet, it, it does drain, but it drains very slowly so, away. Yeah. So would that be a drain or could it be someone else's? But you're not on a shared drain, are you? No, so it's a drain somewhere, eh? Unless, unless you're, you're I mean, on a shared drain, I don't, which I don't you're know. not. I don't know, I don't think I am, man. But you, wouldn't, you wouldn't have a manhole right no, next to your back I, door if it no, was... No, I think all these houses have their own, have their own manholes. Yeah. Yeah. Somewhere. So if that's a breach, Somewhere. Um, it's basically going to happen every now and again, isn't it? Okay, guys, let's get the uh, camera in. I don't know how far in I'm going to get.
All right, so if we have a look at the base of the where the toilet is, there's another bit of a giveaway. Do you see all the green uh, algae on the wall there? And the way all the brickwork has lost its um, cement mortar. That, that indicates to me that there's a rising damp at that area, which is caused by a broken drain. So there you are guys, this drain here needs to be dug out and the toilet needs to be taken out, the floor needs to be dug up. Okay, so, tried to put the camera in, absolutely rammed in there, and uh, it's obvious to me that there's problems in the drain, it's not, it's not, it doesn't come under the remit of a, a basic clearance, so, um, Customer's getting onto his insurance company. It's a problem between there and here. Uh, and let's see what his insurance company says. I may be back here and uh, carrying out the remedial works. But the main thing is that toilet there, I think you see that, is running down that pipe and coming out of the straight junction, which comes directly through to the Windsor trap. Windsor trap's clear. Uh, he's done a couple of flushes on the main toilet. It's all running through. Told him not to use that toilet and if he can reduce the amount of use of the kitchen gully. Uh, the kitchen sink into the gully I should say. So there you go guys. If you like the video hit that like button uh, and um, happy new year. January the 2nd. Let's hope 2024 is a good one for all of you and me.